Let's take a look at the TiVo DVR scheduling application. Um, this is built exclusively for the BlackBerry. It's, it's a kind of cool app in what it does. Uh, it has some glaring emissions that hopefully they're working on, but I highly doubt it because you can't even do it through the web browser. But let's just take a quick look at what you can do. You can do searches by title, actor, director, keywords, category, etc. Uh, daily picks, most popular shows. If we go in here and we're seeing what the most popular shows are, can do daily picks though, that's probably better. And this is showing you for Wednesday today, which it is Wednesday. You see here Modern Family is available. You can see that. We'll go in here, it gives me a description of the program itself. On the bottom I can say check availability. It's available in Boston on channel 5 from 9 to 930. You can do a one-click record, record uh, this episode, get a season pass, um, upcoming episodes, you can look at all that information, and then you can do, if you like this, it, it'll show you some other uh, programming you may like. What you can't do here is you can't see your to-do list, which you can do on TiVo.com, and you cannot actually manage your season pass. So if you go to record a program and it records, it might bop, bump something else out that you weren't expecting, and I really want the application to tell me that, and it doesn't. So um, hopefully that's something they're thinking about for a next revision of it. But, you know, you're on the road. You just want to check out some programming going on. If it's available, send it to your TiVo. Uh, you will get email confirmation, so hopefully everything works out for you and you're able to record the program, and then you can watch it when you get home or if you have something uh, like Sling Media, you can watch it on the road. We go into Settings. You can select a diff different TiVo. In, in this case, I have the main one selected. And you can do one-click recording options and basically saying um, priority only if nothing conflicts. Cancel all the programs if necessary. Uh, DVR default for the quality, etc. So it's available on BlackBerry App World. Just do a quick search for TiVo. You'll find it up there. If you have a TiVo at home, the application is free, the service is free, check it out. It's worth it. Score Mobile for BlackBerry. If you love sports, you've got to have this application. They didn't have the NFL coming out of the gate. They have it now. It's really cool. Um, we're looking at NHL. Here are the games for November 5th. Um, in this case, Boston, Montreal. If I select that. I can add it to my calendar. Actually, I just removed it from the calendar. But if I click here, it will add this game to my calendar now. You can see the Boston Bruins are a favorite. If I go into my calendar application, there we go. I can actually see now for the fifth, Montreal at Boston. So definitely, you know, really cool app. Uh, and again, it's free. It's available on BlackBerry App World. Covers a multitude of sports. Everything, auto racing, uh, football, basketball, golf, college uh, football, college basketball, uh, even soccer is in the application. So uh, let's get out of that. And finally, but not least, we're going to look at Dub Contact Card. This application is great. You, you go to a trade show, how many times you shook someone saying, hey, how you doing? Trade maybe uh, business cards, paper business cards, etc. Trade emails, all that stuff. Why not have Dub on your device? It's supported on Apple. It's supported on Android devices. It's supported on Blackberries. Go ahead and set up a contact card in here. Once you have it set up, you put all your information in there that you want to share with somebody. I have a, a Blackberry Fold. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to click on Send. And you can see it says locating on my other device. I'm clicking on, oops, clicking on sending here. And now it's going to find both devices online. In this case, do you want to connect with Jeff Walkingham? I say yes. And then it's saying it's already uh, loaded because I've already done this before. But now basically what just happened was, I received the contact information because we both had send going at the same time. I can then look in in contacts. I can see the contact and the information. It also says we met on Thursday. gives the date. Boston, Massachusetts. The date's wrong. It's uh, it's Wednesday, but um, 
that's because the calendar I have is uh, the time is wrong in my device. But um, so you know, it's kind of cool. If I could find it to be really useful, one thing it can't do, which is kind of annoying, you can't delete a contact. So if you have 100 contacts from going to CES uh, or Wireless Symposium, whatever conference you go to, and you have all those contacts in there, get back, put them into your contact management, etc. You can't go in and delete them so that the next trade show you go to, you can add in new. Supposedly, it's being worked on. Hopefully, it's it's uh, fixed that soon. Uh, dub me in dot com for more information, or just check it out in the BlackBerry app world. It's called Dub D U B. Again, it's Jeff from ServiceSolution dot com, reminding you to update your BlackBerry Storm to OS five zero if you haven't. And uh, that's it from now. Thanks for watching the video. Thanks.